So, this is part two of the review for the Kingfisher Woodworks uh, Appalachian Hickory Bokken. Um, the reason I like this is because uh, it fits my hand well. It's only uh, 40 inches long, um, 4 inch circumference on the suka, the handle. Uh, my hands tend to be, uh, you know, thin fingers, square palm, uh, so smaller handles tend to work well for me. Although my personal preference is a larger style bokken. But what I thought I'd do is um, I'd take this and uh, kind of take a few whacks at the tree, um, and then that way you can see kind of how much beating this is uh, taking. Um, usually, even when I hit it against the tree, the, the most that it'll do is leave kind of the, uh, you know, kind of green markings and stuff, but no real dents. So we're going uh, to take a look at see how this does. So, uh, no damage, no denting, no bending. Um, they recommend that when you first get this bokken, what you need to do is you need to tap it against the wood uh, or hit it with a small mallet. Just tap it for a while. Uh, because apparently, this type of hickory becomes more dense over time uh, and becomes tougher. So actually, the more you use it, the stronger it gets. So I did spend a good week or so before I started doing some strong testing on this thing. But this is an excellent bokken. Um, I don't think it's going to break anytime soon, so I imagine it'll be with me a while. Uh, if you want, go ahead and check them out, Kingfisher Woodworks. These are the guys that made the bokken for the movie The Last Samurai. Um, this was the style that they used in the movie. Uh, anyway, check it out.